those people who are getting baptized today, they've already made a decision to follow Jesus, but today is their opportunity to go public with it and to tell all of you that they're all in for Jesus. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at Stephanie's baptism story right now. Hi, my name is Stephanie Robertson. I came to know Jesus um, a little bit off and on through my entire life, but more so in the last two years, I um, had some health issues. I was sitting actually in the hospital and had a pastor talking to me about what was going on. And something, I don't remember exactly what they said, but they said something to me and it just kind of like clicked that I was not just loved by the people around me, but by something bigger than me. It kind of started from there and then after I got out, I took that and grew my knowledge of Jesus with the help of not only the church that we're currently in, but my other half as well. Uh, so I'm getting baptized today because I feel that not only is it the right point in my life to do it, but I also want to devote my life to Jesus. I want to thank my boyfriend, Christian, for taking the time to, in ways, I guess, drag me to church and teach me the ways of Jesus. Um, I also want to thank our friend, Tim, for introducing us to this church that kind of soared me into really diving into Jesus more. And I also want to thank Pastor Perry because he, from day one, he made me feel very welcomed at this church. If I could say anything to our church, I would tell them thank you for making it feel like family. All right, Stephanie, we're so excited uh, to be able to celebrate this with you. And, you know, based on your story, uh, we can't wait to see what God is going to do in your life. So, Stephanie, I've got one question to ask you. Uh, who is Jesus to you? He is my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. All right. On your profession of faith, I'm going to baptize you now in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And so we are excited to celebrate two people during this service. And so to get that started off, we're going to take a look at Landon's story right now. Hi, my name is Landon. One way I knew Je become to know Jesus is coming to church. I love Jesus, and I'm so thankful that he died for me today. I want everyone to know that I love Jesus. I just want to tell everybody about Jesus. There's so much people that help me. I want to say thank you to them. I want to say thank you to my parents. And I want to say thank you to Miss Tracy and Perry for always teaching me about Jesus. I'm so excited to be baptized. All right, Landon. Man, many, many people here probably don't know that the first time I met you was on a flag football field. And you were little Landon, and my Landon was big Landon. Um, but here you are, you're making a big decision today to go public with your faith, and we are so excited for you. Uh, I've got one question to ask you, Landon. Who is Jesus to you? My Lord and Savior. Mm, amen. All right, Landon. I'm going to baptize you now in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Hi, my name is Matthew Cormley. Um, I had actually lost my five-year-old child. A guy was driving drunk and he had passed away. 
I was pretty lost. Um, I was going through a bitter divorce as well, and just really didn't know, I guess, the place that I was supposed to be. I was contemplating um, not wanting to be around anymore. I was drinking a lot. I was pretty lost for quite a while. I just happened to drive by the church and it was open. I met, um, actually it was Pastor Perry and explained everything and he led me with the God and here I am. I have found grace and it's because of grace was God and the growth that I've gotten since I have been actually with the church. I want to walk by God's grace. I want to walk beside God and know this is where I'm going to be for the rest of my life. This is where I'm going to go. I just can't wait for what God's got planned. I want to say thank you to Pastor Perry. Um, he's been a model. He's been there um, through everything. Um, all of the guys in the group, those are God's, like, you know, angels right there. Matt, I, uh, you know, I've gotten to get to know you really well. Like you said, I, I was kind of there from the beginning when you walked through these doors and you, you just told me everything that you were going through and, and got to sit right there with you in the corner of those chairs and, and got to experience you giving your life to Jesus and, and I, I got to brag on this guy a little bit. He's gone through a ton. Uh, his, his son was killed by a, by a drunk driver. Um, and he just had, understandably, a lot of bitterness in him. And just in the last couple of weeks, he actually went and met that man and he forgave him. Um, and what's really cool how, how God works is he also got a chance to lead that man to Jesus. Um, so... I'm just thankful for the brother that you are, the, the fact that this decision that you're making today, you, you're already putting it into practice. You are uh, trying to spread the love of Jesus with the people around you. And so it is my privilege to baptize you today. I've got one question to ask you. Who's Jesus to you? That is my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Thank you. All right. I now baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right, so we're just going to pray a prayer of blessing over these two, and then we will uh, we'll let them go get dried off. Okay. Father, we thank you so much for these two men. Help them to continue to live their life for you and continue to share the love of Jesus with the people around them. Thank you for giving us the privilege to celebrate with them this bold decision to go public with their faith in you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 All right.